Yeah, I cut out all the menus, by the way, so. Oh, right, by the way, we're starting. Uh, uh this is 8-Bit Gamer. <laughs> Yo. I'm Killer Instinct. And I'm Poyo Poyo Man. And I'm Toon. And that was a Toon. terrible opening. <laughs> we're just like, oh, right, we're starting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I just randomly said Toon. I'm all like, Toon. <laughs> hey, Toon. Yeah, I'll, I'll call you that from now on. Oh my god, I'm so tired. Uh, yeah, for anyone who's watching, uh, right now we're record. Uh, we're yeah, we're recording this. Uh, and for me, it's 4:05 in the morning, and for them, it's only one. Well, if I'm not well, one for me. It's two, two for me. So yeah. yeah, these lucky guys probably aren't half as tired as I am. I'm tired as hell, constantly yawning, <laughs> and I stayed up just to do this with these guys. So GG. It's because we forced him to. Yeah. Yep. I was uh, I was brought into a room and I had a knife pointed at my neck, and uh, if I didn't do it, I would be stabbed multiple times. Yep. Uh, yeah. I had to um, walk the 600 or 700 miles there, but you know, getting it done. Yeah, we were supposed to do this at two in the morning, but uh, two in the morning my time. But, uh, Jared was late. Yeah, oh, excuse me, I mean Toon. Yeah. <laughs> <This is laughs> late really like, really... How late were you? Uh, an hour and a half? Turn the video off. Um, my name has been exposed. <laughs> yeah. I'm just kidding. Um, I think I was like 50 minutes late. Dude, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It was windy and it was hard to get home. It's like the wind was propelling you backwards while you were trying to go. Yes. Yeah. I wonder if that's actually physically possible. Like some skinny ass kid was like on his longboard and like the wind was blowing so hard one day that like the the wind pushed him backwards on his longboard while he was trying to go forwards. Yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, it sounds plausible. No, obviously yeah, what happened. Or road boarding. No, obviously what happened was um, when we had Thomas trapped up and trapped in the room, Gerard had to go and fight off the cops. That's obviously what Gerard. happened. Gerard. Gerard. Did... I am Gerard. Just right now. <laughs> I, you know, I'm Gerard. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> we Call me. Right. Just. Alan yeah, whatever. I'm calling Jared Gerard, and he just can't help it. I can't I'm help it. I'm tired. I'm kind of tired. Maybe a little. Tired. Tired, huh? <laughs> okay, okay, guys. The game. The game. All right. So, um, right now, Sonic is inside of a forest. As you can see, I do not know what level this is. Poyo, fill us. Um, green forest. Green forest. Uh, I think I've gotten to this level. Wait, is this before Pumpkin Hill? Yeah, this is the level just before Pumpkin Hill. Okay, well then, yeah, I've gone through this one before. Uh, oh, it's just a boss battle. Yeah, well, there's a level after it. Okay. Uh, I'll let you guys commentate. I have to go to the washroom. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll be okay. Wow. <sighs> this game is oh, that was fast. Yeah, it's a pretty easy boss fight. Oh, come on, Shadow! I thought, whatever. Um, this is a pretty, pretty beautiful game. Yeah, it's for pretty, like, it's pretty good looking for the time. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, it's like so much uh, diversity. Like. Right now you're in the jungle, and then there's like the awesome cities. Yeah. I don't know, sorry, I was just replying to a message I got, so... That's cool. <laughs> oh yeah, and by the way, um, for everyone wondering, this is only like the second time we've actually talk talked in person, so that is my excuse for messing up the names. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I guess. Oh, that was awkward. 
square Wait. water. Yeah. Wait, this is a version that I... Okay, good. Um, because I had a couple mishaps, so I wanted to make sure this is the version that I cut out all the badness. <laughs> Mm. Huh. That was. I don't know what happened there. You're supposed to grab onto the grind rail. I don't know why I missed it. It's kind of annoying. I uh, know I haven't played this level in my life, but I swear, like I, well, I don't know. It's just kind of. I'm I'm thinking um, Sonic <sighs> Heroes. You know that jungle level. Yeah. The, jungle level in Sonic Heroes, that's what I keep thinking of, because it's, like, really similar to this. At least from what I remember. I everyone, might be wrong. Yeah, except with less game. Sonic Heroes, hits. everyone always talks about it. I've never played Sonic Heroes. It's meh, honestly. You have to play through the game four times to beat it, so... I mean, I had it for the GameCube, and all I can yeah, remember true. is, like, theme song. It's like, Sonic Heroes! Oh, yeah, not, like, that, that theme song, honestly. was the best theme song for me and my friends. He's saying that. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, the I like only, Sonic Heroes. The only theme songs of Sonic I've ever sung are uh, City Escape and uh, Sonic R. Anything Sonic R, basically. I mean, mm -hmm. it it's so bad it's good. The music is so bad it's good. Yeah, honestly. Have you, have you guys ever heard of Sonic.exe? Oh yeah, yeah, that weird thing. Uh, yeah, I have it on my computer, and I play it every now and then. It's all right. So I know it's... what we're gonna be uh, commentating on next time. Oh my goodness, no! If you guys want, <laughs> if you guys want, I will, I will record that. I'm serious. Well, that would. I mean, I don't think that we have any younger audience. I mean, uh, you know, we'd have to make a poll just to make sure. But I don't think that we have much of a younger audience. Uh, Even if there is a younger check. audience, I'm not, I'm, it's not, there's, there's nothing, like, it's a bad, oh, dang, you know, like, some splotches of pixelated red, ooh. I don't know, but, like, I'm just gonna put this out here, like, I would love to be raunchy and, like, uh, vulgar on these, uh, uh, comment, like, when I commentate, but, I mean, you know, you, I, I have to, we have to keep it safe, because we don't know whether or not, like, we have younger audiences. Like, we're just going to yeah. assume that we do. So we're not going to be too, too, uh, like, you know, explicit. Mm, but, yeah. Yeah. Because I, I know that there's younger yeah. retro gamers out there for sure. Like, I've I've been retro gaming since I'm 10 years old. So, well, before that, because yeah, yeah. I, I had Super Nintendo, with, with, like, long after it was, you know, relevant. So. Yeah. yeah. And, and plus, but, yeah. It's, uh, it's, it's becoming... I think Metro Gaming is oh, getting more into. By the way, this is where I show uh, the power up or whatever. Nice. I would like to do Castlevania stuff too, guys. Yeah, that, that'd be cool. I don't know why, but I'm like really, really tempted to do Mortal Kombat. I don't know why, just because like it's so difficult. Well, I have Ultimate Mortal Kombat three for the uh, Saturn. And oh, like nice. I, I bought a lot of uh, fighters for the Saturn like a while back. I bought uh, Virtua Fighter Remix, Virtua Fighter Two, um, F Fighting Vipers, Fighters Mega Mix, and uh, Virtua Fighter Kids. I don't know if I mentioned it. I can't remember. <laughs> Virtua Fighter. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's basically Virtua Fighter Two, but with. Uh, Everyone has the a giant head. Basically yeah. Ooh. And Here's your uh, either, Halloween. Right? That's uh, the US one. S some Halloween stuff. Oh gosh. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to do some Resident Evil stuff, if we see whether or not we have, uh, you know, some younger audiences. You know, maybe. Just check but, the analytics uh, on the Facebook page or whatever. Also, uh, buy I, I don't. I don't. I don't know. I wouldn't think that that's really a. Well, I mean, whatever. Yeah, I don't like, know. Like, but, I mean, like, blood and gore and stuff, you know? You have to watch out. Yeah, but, I anyways. guess. Well, it depends what... Depends which um, Resident Evil we're using, because really, like, if we're playing, like, Resident Evil 1 or 2, like, it's... It's hardly, uh... Well, well I mean, have you seen I mean. the FMV sequences? Have I seen the what? The FMVs. 
No, I haven't. I don't think so. They're pretty least. gory. They're, they're they're pretty gory, dude. Like um, basically, you can tell what's going on. You you can oh, tell see, that yeah. obviously he's eating up on some guy's yeah. flesh. But anyway. Well, then uh, I guess yeah. I guess when we I guess when we make our video, if we do a Resident Evil, we could just put like a what what is it like? What's the word? Mm, disclaimer or something like warning at the beginning or whatever. Like you know. Hey, we don't even need to. As soon as you start on the game, it tells you this game contains violence and gore. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> game doesn't force. Uh, yep. Yeah, I got, I got, I got, I got that director's cut. Did you see that? Yeah. Oh, well, this I is annoying. Buy it. So, yeah. Like honestly, Jared, if you want to sell that, hit me up. <laughs> and by the way, uh, yeah, I love this Are emerald chart is a real pain. <laughs> Is it really like that yeah, hard to find or something? Like, well, in this version, you'll get the exclamation point. So it's like, I don't know, because there's, there's the red, but I don't know where in the red I'm supposed to be looking. The problem is, in Sonic Adventure 2, it's randomly generated and it's bas it's really finicky. Like finding it, like it'll it'll say you're close to it, but you're actually not. Like you would you, like, let's say he's right there, for example. It could say that it's yellow, but you'll find it there like I don't know it's I, I I found it to be finicky when I played this level and it annoyed me to the point where I shut off the console which I touched on when we weren't recording yeah oh so yeah it can be a total pain in the ass I feel kind of dumb looking back on this now because it's kind of because I'll just tell you guys now the emerald shard is like on the wall behind the back of the pumpkin but yeah, like you talk to any of the things that I give you hints yeah, I, I talked to the uh, uh, some of the things, and I got the hints, but I just, I don't know, I just didn't get them or whatever. Sometimes, the uh, hints are basically useless. I mean, I've found. Yeah. Oh, they, they basically don't even help you. But sometimes, they're really, really helpful, like, uh, like behind, a big, uh, behind a big pumpkin. So, look for a big pumpkin, simple enough, right? Yeah. But other times, I think... they don't make so much sense. What were you gonna say, Jared? Um, I was just gonna say, like... I was just gonna say, I think I'm gonna buy... A new capture card. So we can actually get some yeah. footage. If any of you guys no. don't know... Um... Poyo Poyo Man has a really good capture card. It's pretty obvious. Uh, what kind <laughs> of capture card is it? Um, it's a, it's just Gigaware. That's the brand name. I've never heard of him. All right, so he has a decent one, as how, you can tell. How did you get that? Uh, Radio Shack. Oh, like, really? Radio, like online or at the store? At the store. How much was it? Forty dollars. Oh, well, I only paid ten. Wait, what? Oh, well, that's better. I mean. <laughs> but anyways. Okay, well, I. Think... Me and Jared yeah. bought okay. the East Cap. So, and it didn't work yeah. out very well, let's just say. Yeah, for Jared, for Jared, his didn't work at all upon arrival. And for me, mine actually yeah, worked no. pretty well. But uh, mine does ghosting. Uh, like, it'll record, but at some point, the frames will get, like, intertwined together. It's hard to explain, but, like, y you see ghostage, basically, of what you saw, like, seconds before. <clears throat> Which, it can be annoying, but it stops, like, eventually. Like, it only happens every once in a while. So, yeah, it's pretty finicky, but it, it gets the job done. But uh, for most of our commentaries, if we can get Poyo Poyo to do it, we'll get him to do it. Because he has a superior capture card. Yeah. It, yeah. It took, like, a week and a half for my easy cap to arrive and then it got here and it didn't even work came with like some super yeah, outdated software dang yeah uh mine didn't come with the correct software it came and with yeah, it uh, with vhs the... to dvd huh. so it didn't do mine basically what i told it to do mm. i don't know like yep. I'm not entirely sure, honestly, if I'm setting it up right, but, like, 
because I've seen like all these setups with like the Y and the, you know, like the Y splitters and stuff. Yeah. But I'm not doing that. I'm doing it with like out the Y splitters, and I'm just like yeah plugging in. Yeah. Well, I cheaped out it. Eh? Well, you don't need the Y splitters, but the catch is if you don't use them, you're gonna have to like look on a little little tiny screen where you're capturing your footage from the program. That's what I do. But, but I, yeah, I cheaped out and. Uh, I took my VCR and I hooked up my console to the back of the VCR and I ran the output through a coax cable into my giant TV and then the output ports which are AV I ran out into the capture card so it goes through the VCR out to the TV and then through the AV ports in the back of the VCR out to the capture card. Hmm. So that's oh, my wide right. footers. So does that require yep. so like two male? Does that require like two double ended? Um, what's the word? Like yellow, red, white cords. What are those things called? Male things. Well, we're gonna talk about <laughs> that after because the video yeah. is about to end. So yeah. In fact, I think it went, ended. Uh, yeah, cause I. That, yeah. Yeah, I have. We're gonna finish up here, to... guys. Um, so yeah, that's our second yeah. part of the Sonic Two uh, <laughs> commentary. Let's yeah, play. sorry for getting carried away, uh, but uh, I hope yeah, you guys Yeah, thank you. Enjoyed. Yeah, thanks yeah, for watching. So see you guys later. See you. Yeah, subscribe.